Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to print screen or take a screenshot on your HP NVIDIA X360 laptop. So, to open the screenshotting mode, you can either press on Windows, Shift and S at the same time, then it'll open the screenshotting mode, as you can see, which I'm going to explain in a moment. You can also instead find the print screen button. If it's a singular button, so it's only print screen, then um, you can just click on that. But on HP and VX360, it has two functions. The primary function is shift. And to use the print screen, you'll need to click on FN, then shift. So it will work the same as the Windows Shift S. You can see I can click on Windows Shift Right Shift and it also opens this screenshotting tool. And now I'm going to explain this tool. So what you can see here at the top is the camera icon and the movie camera icon. So this will take a screenshot. This will take a screen recording. So let's first uh, talk about the screenshots. So when, I'm, when I have this option selected, then I can choose rectangle, window, full screen or freeform. First, let's take a rectangle. You can just draw the rectangle that you want to screenshot. You can also do it with a finger. Then it's automatically uh, copied to your clipboard and saved to the screenshots folder so let me show you that you can paste it everywhere so let's like go to maybe paint obviously you're not gonna be paste, pasting, it, pasting it to paint all the time but um, I just want to show you that you can paste it anywhere so let's find paint and let's just paste it here so I'm gonna Press and hold, or no, let's click on file, edit, yes, edit, then click on paste. You can also, instead of doing that, you can on your keyboard click on Ctrl and V, and it'll also paste it, as you can see. Although, um, now let's move on to the next thing, which was the, maybe let's leave this window open. And let's click on Window Shift S or FN Right Shift. Then let's select the Window option. Now you need to hover over a window you want to screenshot. You can see it highlights. Click on that and it'll be screenshotted. It's also copied to your clipboard and saved to your screenshots folder. You can also click on the notification always. Then you can draw something or, or do other stuff. Let me show you. You can see here I have a ballpoint pen selected so I can draw and also change its color. So I can, for example, select something. Let's do like an arrow to show it. You can also highlight something. You can erase. Just like that. You can also draw shapes, but I'm not gonna get into that now. You can also save it here to select save location or copy it from here. So after editing, you'll need to copy it as a new um, thing. And also I'm gonna show you where to find it in the screenshots folder, which I've mentioned before. So go to your file explorer and the screenshots folder will be either in the OneDrive. So if you have OneDrive logged in, then you'll have pictures here you can go into that then see screenshots or you can go to pictures then screenshots here and you can see there are my two screenshots now let's take a full screen screenshot so I click on this three buttons at once now let's select full screen as uh, and as soon as I click on it it just takes the screenshot and let's take the last screenshot which was freeform click here and then select freeform. Now draw the area you want to screenshot and it will screenshot it in that area. 
Now also I'm gonna show you the screen recording. So let's click on screen recording. Now you need to select the area that you want to screen record. So I'm gonna like draw it maybe all the screen without the taskbar. Now you can enable or disable the microphone and you can enable or disable recording system audio. So I'm gonna enable both, then click on start. Then it will start counting down from free. And now it is recording. So I can like do anything I want. Then I can stop recording and it'll open this window with the recording. I can play it to preview it. It's recording. So I can like do anything. And you can see it works. It also says that screen recordings are automatically saved to your screen recordings folder. So let's see that. Let's open the file explorer, then go to videos, screen recordings, and here it is. And this is all about screenshotting your um, on your HP NVX360 laptop. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.